Hi, Chris Walls from Second Swing. We're in Mission Viejo, California today with Srixon Golf, talking about 2018 Z-Series irons. I'm with Brian Schelke. Brian, good to see you. Yeah, thanks for, having, thanks for having me, Chris. This is exciting. We've got three new irons to talk about, the Z585, the Z785, and then the ZU85 utility irons. We're gonna talk about each one individually, but one of the things that I know is important for your uh, customers to know is that these were really designed for players to blend sets and, and really work seamlessly together. Yeah, exactly. So Strixon irons were really about fitting, customization, and giving golfers their dream set of irons. We see out on tour, all of the guys are mixing and matching sets and set makeup, you know, people inside the building mix and match their set, their long irons versus their short irons. So we really want to give consumers that those same abilities. And so we'll start with the 785. It's more of a, a, you know, a true player's iron, forged, compact blade shape, beautiful looking. I played the 765 yeah. iron and there's been some real modifications made here, both in terms of playability and shaping. Yeah, exactly. From a shaping standpoint, we really wanted to make these a, a bit more workable. They're, they're true player's irons. They're one piece forged from a single billet of carbon steel. And to make them more workable, we made the short irons a little bit more compact, a little bit nicer looking, which really appeals to the, a lot of the better players. And then the second thing we did was we moved some weight around. We actually have kind of a little triangular uh, tour cavity design in them, and that helps increase the workability. So with these irons, you can hit them high, you can hit them low, you can hit them right to left, left to right. Really, you can do anything you want with the 785 irons. And one of the reasons that Strixon irons have been so popular in recent years is the V-Soul. And yeah. this year, you've made a slight modification to what's the new, the new Tour VT-Soul. Tell us sort of a little bit about what's different there. Yeah, the VT sole really has been a big driver of the popularity of these irons and what our tour guys love. And it adds a little bit of bounce on the leading edge, kind of that V shape, and which so they can hit down as hard as they want at the ball and it just slides smoothly through the turf. It really helps them with feel. And then for other golfers, if even if you hit a hair behind the ball, it maintains more club head speed through the turf so that you can kind of maintain that distance. So if you hit it a, hit a little behind it, rather than missing 10 yards short of the green, you're missing front edge of the green. So it really provides some performance benefits. And the new VT sole is a little bit different in terms of it's just a little bit more severe in the very center of the club and then a little bit um, of heel and toe relief as you get towards the perimeter just to help it slide through the turf better. And now with the 585, a little bit of a different animal, going to be a little bit more ball speed thanks to a face insert. Tell us about the SGP-10 face insert and how that impacts performance. Yeah, well the 7 series are really geared towards workability. The 5 series have great feel but then also are more geared towards distance. So the perimeter of the iron is forged out of the same soft 1020 carbon steel. Yet there's a face insert, the SUP-10 as you said, and so that helps us go a little bit thinner for more flex and more ball speed. And new to the 585 irons is a speed groove that's basically a milled channel within the high strength steel face. And what that channel does is creates even more flex around the perimeter for more ball speed. So these irons still look really beautiful. They still feel really good. They're forged, yet kind of give some more of those game improvement um, ball flight and, and ball speed. Yeah, and you could really feel uh, the ball almost f felt like it stayed on the face yeah. just that split second longer with the 585s and then just kind of exploded. Yeah, exactly. It's definitely the longest kind of player's distance iron out there. And the other thing about it that's worth mentioning too is that shaping even seems to be maybe a little bit more compact than the 565. Really beautiful. Yeah, exactly. Especially in the short irons where people don't need quite the same forgiveness. Um, we have gone a little bit more compact, a straighter top line, um, just to give that true player shape in them. And then the long irons still have plenty of forgiveness to help get the ball up in the air and kind of drop it softly on the greens. And we're going to talk about the utility iron in a second, but one thing I want to touch on before we move to that is in the 585, the Nippon Modus 105 is the stock shaft. Yeah. In the 785, it's the Nippon Modus 120. But 
in terms of manufacturers, you guys offer a better, more comprehensive line of no upcharge premium and aftermarket shafts than just about anybody. Touch on that for a minute if you would. Yeah, again, similar to kind of the ability to mix and match and build your set, you know, from long irons to short irons and combinations. You know, our tour guys and, you know, people internally, we have all the options to every shaft we want so we can really maximize our performance. Um, and so we want to give those same, that same ability to consumers so they can maximize their performance with whatever shaft they want. So we have a vast array of kind of no upcharge steel shafts and grips. So you can go and pick whichever shaft you're used to playing, whichever one fits your swing best and put them in these irons at no upcharge. Yeah, and again, let's going back to the, the ZU85. This is kind of an unsung hero for you guys. It's been the number one utility played out on tour. Uh, players just love it, and the new one is really looks outstanding. Yeah, exactly. The new U85 is exciting for us. It builds off some of the success of their past utilities, you know, the tour success, um, and then also just our performance in testing. Once you get in oh, there, yeah. you're it's full cool commitment. That'll play. They're basically long iron replacements that you can hit, you know, from the fairway, from the rough, or off the tee. But they're just more forgiving than um, typical long irons. They're full hollow construction, which moves the weight a little bit lower, a little bit deeper to give those forgiveness um, technologies. But they still look beautiful. They look like pure blade long irons, and they feel great. So I think that's really contributed to the to the success of them, and our, our tour guys love them just because they don't have to work quite as hard with their long irons than they used to because they have these utilities. And you mentioned feel, these forged as well from 1020 carbon, which is super soft. And the one thing I want to mention from getting to hit uh, some earlier was that a lot of times with a hollow construction, there's really sort of a noticeable click, yeah. not a real solid feel, but you would never know this was hollow when you hit it. Yeah, exactly. It has a high strength face, but the forged construction all around that really dampens the vibration to give them great feel through impact. Yeah. Really awesome looking new stuff. Brian, we appreciate it. Cool. Thanks, Chris. Thanks.